you're with us, Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the Metro Manila Arena here in the Philippines. Our main event should be a good one tonight. 12 rounds in the heavyweight division between these two great warriors. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue court, James Latatari! And his opponents, fighting out of the blue court, Bill! All right, gentlemen, one thing, protect yourself at all times, okay? Well, they've been waiting for this moment, and now they get it. Round one underway. Tony able to land the counterpunch. More than one, and it's just what he wants. Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by James Tony. Looking counter punch. It's been a recent trend, Teddy, where we've seen in the heavyweight division a lot of Eastern Europeans dominating. Why do you think that is? Same thing in basketball. I don't think they're the better athletes, but you know what? There's an urgency. There's a real hunger. This is their opportunity. The fighters over here and the basketball players for that part, they have too many options here. Over there, they make the most of it, and fundamentally, they're very sound. Nice block by Big. Halfway through round number one. those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Good stuff in the opening two minutes. A minute to go in this round. James Tony with a nice counter punch. This is great action right from the start. What an opening round between these two. by Big. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by James Tony. Good work with the combination, putting his punches together and it's paying off. Yeah, it is paying off. You know, the first couple didn't get there, but he caught him on the back end. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by James Tony. <laughs> Targeting the hooks on each man. Oh, that's good stuff. Oh, and there you go. James lights out. Tony stunned, and he is hurt. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Nice combination, throwing more than one, both scored there. Keep your 
much being tested here even though he's likely up on the scorecards he's getting a real test here yeah joe a test that will serve him in the future if he goes on to win this fight which i think he will he's going to take what he learned here today what he gained here today and it's going to serve him as he moves forward in his career and now he's acting like a fighter coming back with the right hand after getting scored upon job of just timing things there with the counter punch early in this fight well timing i'm glad you said that timing because timing is connected to counter punching it was a beautiful job a stinging counter punch after some fine defense by big again to the melon Final 10 seconds of round number two. Fine fundamentals, good counter punch. That worked out really well. Throw it off the right hand after getting tagged like that. So here we are, a new round underway, and in that last round, he got tagged. He got hit pretty hard, Teddy. Yeah, he did. He got caught. Now, the first thing is, we all know he got caught, but why did he get caught? He has to be able to decipher that in his head. He has to be able to have the answer to that so it doesn't happen again. Good job by drawing in his opponent and then landing the counterpunch by Big. James Tony's not showing us that he understands just how effective he can be if he went downstairs against his opponent. Yeah, well, you know what you're saying, Joe? You're taking a peek, and you're taking a swipe. Right? Oh, and there you go. Oh, that uppercut got him badly. Come on now, work it out. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. Oh, very nice. Smart counter punch there. Yeah, that's beautiful. You make the guy miss, you make him pay. You always say punchers are born, Teddy. But what about a guy's ability to withstand big punches? What about a guy's chin? You know, that's an interesting point. Part of it is physical, and you know what it is? It's the neck. That's the shock absorber, but most of it's mental. You have to want to take the punches. You have to will yourself through the punches. This guy has some will. <laughs> Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Nice block by Big. Good block by Big. Turns on that exchange. What a good counter punch by Big. Big's putting together punch stats tonight that fall right in line with what his strategy is. Outside fighter, throwing lots of jabs, landing lots of jabs. Well, what it is is the jab is the table setter. And the jab tonight has set up the table where he's been able to eat whatever he's wanted. Excellent 
counter punch by Big. He returns the favor with a right hand of his own. Ten seconds to go in this third round. James Tony's got a cut. It looks like it's below the eye on the cheek, but it's something that needs to be monitored. End of the round here, a round that saw a lot of action. The kind of round that fans pay to be here to see. Well, these are TV-friendly fighters, and we figured that coming in. Keeping his hands up, getting way of his opponent's effort. Side to side, move your head. Tony able to land the counter punch. Takes one, but gets one. Good work by James Tony. Well, he's got the attitude, something's got to stick. He fires off the combination, and they both do. James Tony with a block punch there. A little defense turns to offense by Big. Well done by James Tony. And a smart counter punch by Big. The twists and turns and the non-stop battle. It continues on as we've reached the one-minute mark to go. Good job with another left hand. That's as good as it gets right there. A crushing uppercut by James Tony. How about that? Another right hand. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. This is a defense. He's tired. Able to block that away. It was targeted for his head. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by James Tony. The action starts up again, but it's only favored one man. Hard to see this fight going to distance based on what we've witnessed so far. Teddy, is this becoming a mental thing with him? I mean, he's not firing off the big power punches. I got to wonder why. You know, that's a good question. Sometimes a guy is making a solid agreement in his mind that maybe if I don't hit him hard, he won't hit me hard back. He's not confident enough now to throw the punches without worrying about what to come back at him. Big's doing really well on the outside, utilizing his jab. James lights out. Tony's got to be feeling the impact of that uppercut. Nice strike after catching one by James Tony. Fight. I mean, just a great fight. Both guys giving their all back and forth. It doesn't get much better. Once again to the head. Fire. 
well done by Big. Good block by James Tony. It's been two minutes of non-stop action. Now the final minute has arrived. A well-targeted classic one-two by Big. Big's doing a really nice job here. I mean, putting his punches together. This is what you're supposed to look like as an offensive fighter. Yes, it is, especially when you have a guy in front of you putting the earmuffs on. You know, you cover up the way that his opponent is. You're supposed to put them together. One or two are going to be blocked. But when you put them together like that, they're going to get through. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. The end to another very entertaining round in what has been a very entertaining fight. A fight where there's just bad intentions. The fight that just doesn't have the feel of a fight that's gonna be a decision win for somebody. Looks like somebody's gonna get stopped. Right from the beginning, they've been fighting with desperation. Like, going the decision, as you just touched on, has not been in their minds at all. James Tony blocks that punch. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. You get the sense that they know no other way how to fight. They are going at it, back and forth, toe-to-toe, -to -toe, punch for punch. combo by Big. He's committed to that left hand and it's working out. Big's making for a trainer's dream right now. Picking his shots, Teddy. Selecting when, where, and being very accurate. Yeah, the old timers would say he's a real sharpshooter. That's exactly what he's doing. He's not missing much. job fighting from the outside. James Tony's getting caught with headshots. But Teddy, to me this is pretty simple. Move your head. Otherwise the other guy will. And he's been moving his head for him all night. Halfway through what is one of the best rounds you'll ever see. Just great action. Now, it's unbelievable. I mean, if you love roller coasters, you go to an amusement park. If you want to see left hooks, right hands, every direction, great chins, great endurance, great heart, you come to this fight. You stay right here. James Tony with a nice counter punch. <laughs> point of this main event. Parries that punch intended for the head. Oh, flush to the midsection with the counter shot. 
They trade shots. He comes back with a right hand. Good fundamental work landing the one two there. He gets off with a combination up top. James, oh, that's got to hurt. James lights out. Tony's in a bad place right now. He was tagged. There it is. James lights out. Tony's gone down. How will he recover from this? up after that punch put him down on the canvas now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy putting his punches together landing two shots there how about a return to center with the left hand on target there with a three punch combination Tony able to land the counter punch they are bringing out the best in each other I mean you can just tell when they meet up in the middle of this ring, they're bringing out the best in each other. up nicely gets rid of his opponent's body shot you can see he's trying to score up top but off the mark there wow oh what a counter shot by james tony end of that round and the knockdown was scored. Now, Teddy, the fighter who was floored, how do you treat him? Do you, go, do you go soft on him when he comes back, or do you get right in his face? What's the way to approach him? You have to know your fighter. You have to know the temperament of your fighter. Some guys, you know, they just kind of crawl up into a ball, and they don't come out of it if you get too strong with them. Other guys... Oh! James lights out. Tony's been stunned. Hey, 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 no holding, no holding. Biggs is doing very nicely on the outside here in this fight. Oh, boy, look at this. Right from the get-go, they go after one another. They remind me of my 15-year-old son going to the dinner table. James Tony is showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. He is hurt and damaged, but he's doing a real nice job of just staying away from the danger. And now he's got to find a little bit of a way to create offense without getting into that danger zone again. This is why we love the sport, Kenny. Holy cow! James lights out. Tony stunned him. He is hurt. He is stunned there, and now he ties up. He ties up, and he was allowed to tie up, and that's what he's going to be sorry for, the other guy, that he allowed himself to get grabbed. And he goes down again. Will he get up from this?
but able to get up to his feet. Teddy, what should he be thinking about now? Well, right now, just surviving. <laughs> Unbelievable. Just the barrage continues. He's knocked down again. But his desire and heart is just as strong as it was before. He can go on much longer here. No, he's going to need to grab a little bit. Take a little time off that clock. Come on, guys. Punch it out. Punch it out. No holding. Diggs is trying to push away. He wants to breathe a little. Gets rid of that body shot. Keep busy, guys. Come on now. Keep busy. Oh, that's got to hurt. James lights out. Tony stunned and staggered. Hey, 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 no holding, no holding. Let's punch it out. Oh, he's in late goings here of this round, and he goes down. Can he survive it? One, two, three, four, five. So that's it. Unable to rise up and beat the count. A knockout victory. Walk right into that one. Let's make it official. And for that, we send it up to our ring announcer. He's your winner by knockout victory. I feel like I just came out of the movie theater, Joe, and I did not expect that ending. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Have yourself a great evening.